hello everyone how is it going welcome back to another video all right guys so uh yeah you know before we proceed i just wanted to let you know that there is one very uh interesting thing that have happened yesterday which we're going to talk about in the later part of the video to do stick around till the end of the video uh to know that all right guys so let's begin the video with arena since we don't have uh, any solo raids you know so okay we recently completed tier 7 as well so i'll show you guys the rewards what i received on completing tier 7 all right so 10.6 million points 23 victories and i'm on rank 99 barely on invincible so with another so you know i would say 12 million points i should be there on invincible uh but yeah you know i think uh, this is something that i've been looking forward to you know reaching invincible in the last season i was on invincible and i'm having a uh, you know, I'm, I'm getting the strong feeling that I will be reaching Invincible going forward on every season in the arena. All right, guys, let's buy some shards for Horrific Scarecrow. Let's get this guy to five stars. Not today, obviously, but in the coming days, he will be on five stars. So we need 235 uh, shards, yeah. 225 35 shards more okay so speed for the flash classic superman is maxed out almost unhinged harley quinn predator batman is already on five stars okay maybe i'll buy some shards for atlanta armor aquaman as well in the coming days uh, you know what let's just buy it yeah i don't think it's gonna hurt us okay there we go just 50 uh shards more all right guys now moving on uh let's jump into solo i'm sorry champions arena yes so i did play uh you know a lot of champions arena this morning and i'm on 82 points and we still have three days left if i'm getting 80 points every day so in the remaining in the next three days i should be around 360 points uh, or at least above 300 points which should be more than enough for me to get myself on the next division actually there we go the guy who's in rank one is having 303 points i am having 82 points right now 83 84 i think uh but yeah you know i think if if in case i get more than 300 points in the remaining three days i will most definitely get myself to division number two and maybe you know maybe you never know i might also get myself to division one you know in the next week or so but yeah i'm i mean you know it's looking it's looking really good you know the pips i think got refreshed quite recently a few minutes ago and uh let me just check yep the pips got refreshed so if i play a few more fights over here and if i get try to get myself to division two then there is quite a good chance that i might also uh you know gain enough points to reach on division one if i reach division one whatever happens i'm just not gonna get demoted down after that i mean obviously even not from here i'm not gonna try to get myself uh, demoted even from division three uh, or division two but i think division two is a place where i will get 1600 gems i'm getting 1400 right now 1600 gems and 20 prismatic shards and 50 prismatic shards on division one i mean this will boost the progress that i'm currently making uh you know i can use these prismatic shards on any characters i want except for the legendary ones i can use it on harley quinn i can use it on uh, king uh, i'm sorry king and batman the drone are already maxed i can use it on batman ninja team i can use it on silver banshee anything i want you know so that's the good thing of reaching division one getting more prismatic shards plus we get 60 class shards and how can we forget about 1800 gems you know that is also very important and uh, you know i think i'm i'm basically having really high hopes of going on to division two after today and i know i'm currently uh on rank 73 but i still have to play for three more days which means i can easily get myself at least 300 plus points and get over rank 20 and get myself to division two all right guys now let's move on uh let's move on in the store so it's the same chests that we saw yesterday uh you know i'm actually waiting for the raven's legendary chest to come out i have already got zatanna 
I've already got, uh, uh, you know, Black Adam. You know, these are percentage damage dealers. Uh, and Zatanna can increase the damage as well for your damage dealer. Uh, so, yeah, with these two, I think it's high time now that I go for Raven on this account. And, uh, you know, as far as the uh, LOA team is concerned, I think I'm getting enough uh, class shards from Champions Arena now. And even I'm going to start getting Prismatic shards. So, and I'm requesting those shards as well in the league rates. You know, uh, uh, as a matter of fact, uh, just quite recently, I think today, I got my Harlequin from my Lord Lucifer's account to five stars, not beta voids. So I'm not going to request sh her shards anymore for a while. And then, uh, you know, I think I might use, uh, I might actually donate all my shards to people who are requesting Harlequin and uh, obviously on beta voids account. All right, guys, so there is nothing to talk about in the store today. It's pretty much the same thing that we saw yesterday. So let's move on in the roster. Okay. All right. So, uh, yeah, before we finish the video, I will also show you guys uh, the raid rewards that I received. And what, as a matter of fact, let's just jump into the inbox right now. And let me show you tier 7 league raid rewards, what I've received. I was in rank 11. That's a bit far away. Captain Cole, Captain Cole, Armored Superman. Nothing good. Nothing good. Okay. Uh, you know, I think... Yeah, this is what I wanted to show you guys. Take a look at this. A five-star Black Manta. I don't know if you guys have seen that video that I uploaded yesterday evening. Uh, but yeah, you know, in this video... Uh, in that video, I basically defeated Batwoman the Drowned. And I got a five-star legendary Black Manta as a raid reward, as a solo raid reward. I did work a little bit on him. Now, the good thing is that I have the passives to level five. You know, take a look at this. 250% of Black Manta's attack stat is applied as DOT for 20 seconds. What else do you need? I mean, this guy will be a beast if I am able to unlock uh, his gears. You know, he will keep, he will basically change the uh, direction where I'm going in, in solo raid especially. And even in the league raid, if I get his gears, that's very important, you know, to get his gears. Maybe I'll go for the power up chest as well before I go for Raven, you know, get some gears for Black Manta. You know, at least bare minimum, if I get three gears for him, it should be more than enough. Okay, let's get this particular piece of gear. It's been a long time since I haven't up upgraded this piece of gear. Let's get it to level 50 and then we'll move on uh, and we'll get uh, the gears for Harley Quinn. You know, I think my Batum in the Drowned is decently strong right now with the addition of the fifth gear. So I'm going to go and get these gears to level 50 first. And it's going to go to all, all the way to 46. I do have uh, some of these reforges, which I may use in the coming days, but not today. Not today. All right, guys. So, yeah, I guess that's about it for the video. You know, if you enjoyed it, give it a like and let's meet again in the next video. Until then, guys, have a great day. Take care and have a good one. Bye-bye.